follow the miracles of Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. The story of the camel uh, which wept and complained to the Prophet, peace be upon him. Imam uh, Abu Dawood narrated of the authority of the, uh, Abdullah ibn Jafar who said, One day I was riding behind the Prophet, peace be upon him, and he told me secretly about a matter which I should not mention to anybody at all. Uh, when the messenger of Allah, uh, peace be upon him, liked uh, most to hide behind while um, relieving himself was an elevated piece of land or a winding group of uh, palm trees. One day he went inside a garden which belonged to one of the Ansar and there was a camel which upon seeing the messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, started weeping and tears fell from its eyes. The Prophet, peace be upon him, went to the camel and rubbed his ear and so the camel became quiet and stopped crying. The messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, asked, Who is the owner of this camel? A young man from the Ansar came and said, It is mine, O messenger of Allah. The Prophet, uh, peace be upon him, said, to him, don't uh, don't you uh, fear uh, fear Allah regarding this dumb animal, which Allah gave you as your own property? The camel uh, complained uh, to me that you do not give him enough food and that you force him to work until he gets too tired. The messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, is informed about the poisoned sheep. Imam al-Bukhari narrated on the authority of uh, Abu Huraira who said, When Khaybar was uh, conquered, uh, Allah's messenger, peace be upon him, was presented with a poisoned roasted sheep. Allah's messenger, peace be upon him, said, Collect for me all the Jews present in this area. Uh, when they were gathered, Allah's Messenger, peace be upon him, said to, to them, I am going to ask you about something. You will tell me the truth. They replied, yes, uh, um, Abu, uh, Abu, uh, Abu Qasim, uh, which means Allah's Messenger, peace be upon him, said to them, Who's your father? They said, our father is so and so. Allah's Messenger said, you have told a lie, for your father is so and so. They said, no doubt, you have said the truth and done the correct thing. He again said, if I ask you about something, will you tell me the truth? They replied, yes, uh, or oh, Abu uh, Qasim. And if, you, uh, if we should tell a lie, you will know it as you have known it regarding our father. Allah's Messenger, peace be upon him, then asked, Who are the people of the hellfire? They replied, We will remain in the hellfire for a while, and then you Muslims will uh, replace us uh, in it. Allah's Messenger, peace be upon him, said to them, You will uh, abide, uh, abide in it with uh, ignominy, ignominy by Allah, we shall never replace you in it at all. Then he asked them again, If I ask you about something, will you tell me the truth? They replied, Yes, he asked, Have you put the poison in this roasted sheep? They replied, Yes, he asked, What made uh, you do that? They replied, We intended to learn if you were a liar, in which case, we would be relieved from you, and if you were a prophet, then it would not harm you.